What the? Hello, everybody. Welcome to Dreaming Mary. I found this on, I think, RPGmaker.net. It's another creepy, like, cute horror game. They say that you can avoid horror elements in the game by staying in this, like, dream world, but we're gonna try not to do that. It also says there are four different endings, so I want to see how many I can find. Let's get into it. I didn't even know if this game was real. This could have been a virus. I didn't even look it up. I didn't even try to find out first. Mari. Always remember that if you can do anything in your dreams, Always remember that you can do anything in your dreams if you try. You can change your life through your dreams. You have that kind of power. Find the key that turns dreams into reality and the entire world will open up for you. But Mari, be careful. If you fall too far into your dreams, you won't ever wake up. It's like some Fatal Frame, fatal frame 3 crap. Welcome to the dream. Please adjust your volume. Okay. Now that that's over with, let's take a short break. Next up on the music, Nightmarish by Harmonic Blend. All right, cool. There is a vase with a pretty white flower in it. Two of the petals have fallen off. Take the flower, I guess. The door is locked. Mary. How does she favor them? Yes, indeed, Isaiah. Mary's favorite dreams are the long ones that take her deep and away into different worlds. She doesn't like short dreams because they start going dark and still and scary. Okay. There's a chocolate on the bed. Eat it. There's something hard inside. It's a key. Okay, finally. Any more freaky deaky shit? Okay, great. Let's get the hell out of here. This is pretty. I saw the screenshots for this. Okay. Uh, okay. Hi, bunny lady. Oh, hello there, Mary. Is it Mary or Mari? What the frick is going on? How do I know you? Why, that's silly. Are you saying you don't remember me? No, no, no. I remember you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, what a sweet girl. Of course you wouldn't forget me. There's only one Bonilda in your dreams, after all. I don't know why that made me think of Bonehelda from The Sims. Since it's been such a long time, why don't you go visit the others? I'm sure... Penguindel next door would love to see how much you've grown. How long has it been since I was asleep? There's an empty podium. The gold fruit is a prize for the winner. Okay. I can't go that way. That's a ball. All right. Okay, bye. But the children are cursed, and only the gold remains. What? Oh, is that a penguin? I just suddenly thought of the jack-in-the-box guy. Mary, is that you? Why? What a surprise. It's been years, hasn't it? You've certainly grown since last we met. Would you like to read some books? Feel free to look around. This is your dream after all. You want to say hello to Fox Sand when you're done? She'll be ecstatic to know that you're here again. Go toddle along now. So are there like multiple worlds like Yume Niki? Which I've been meaning to play. I have Yume Niki. 
I haven't loaded it up yet. I haven't played it yet. Let me know if I should play that. I don't know if that's like a, a recording game or a stream game. It looks pretty long. Sleeping Beauty, page three. Finally, she came to an old tower. A narrow stairway would led up to it. Being curious, she climbed up until she came to a door. There was a small yellow key in the door. She turned it and the door sprang open. She found herself in a small room where an old woman sat spinning flax. Okay. <laughs> That's creepy though. I have, I have like fatal frame two trauma. I don't like hearing laughing girls behind doors. Thank you. It, it bothers me immensely. Mary, is that you? Look, look at you growing up on me, hunk kid. Can't believe you hadn't even stopped to visit these past years. How long has it been since I slept? You're not leaving again anytime soon, kiddo. Not if I can help it. What's that mean? You should go talk to Boris first, then we can play some games together like in the old days. Just go down the stairs at the end of the hall. You can't miss that door. It's the only one after mine. Mm. Mm hmm. Is that a person passed out on the table? They said that this was inspired by, uh, like, Yume Niki and Madoka Magica. Open the door. There's a door with four holes in it. Uh. Oh, Mary, sweetheart, you're back. I missed you, darling. Isn't this place beautiful? And it's all for you, dear. For tonight, why don't you go play with the others? We can have our own special time later. All right, sweetie. What? I'm a child, you fucking freak. Uh, run. Why is that in your dream, Mary? I don't like that. Can I, can I wake up now? Can I leave? I got one person saying they want to keep me here. Big fluffy bed. Okay, wake up, bitch. Pinch yourself. Creepy painting. Let's see if the radio says anything else. The next set of questions is from Sonwe. The first one is, Mary in the dream has pink hair and a pink dress, but does she look like that in the waking world? That's an excellent question, Sunwe. Mary in the real world is very different. In fact, her name isn't even Mary. In the real world, Maddie has brown hair and Maddie. Dress, and she wears large sweaters and a long brown skirt. Okay, I understand why there were two different names now. His next question is, how is Mary's life outside of dreaming? Does she have any likes besides dreaming? I'm gonna sip my juice. Oh, Okay. She doesn't go to school, but she has a tutor. Sorry, microphone. I didn't mean it. Just gonna go ahead and save. The next question was sent anonymously. Here's the first one. Does Mary have any kind of special power or an iconic item? Good question. Interesting. Another question from Sunray. From whom did Mary inherit her power? Her mom or her dad? And what kind of person was her mother before she passed? Mary got her power from her mom. Mary's mom was a silent woman who loved Mary very much and was always kind. But she could be cryptic and mysterious too. She tried her best to help Mary with learning her powers, but unfortunately she fell into a cold she could finish what she started. Wow. Wow. Okay. You know what? I want to go talk to some of these people and see what, um, see what's going on. Welcome back. Are you having fun in your dream? Say, if you're not busy, could you help me? I just can't figure out how to arrange these statues. 
it's a puzzle. You see, there's actually a story behind these statues. Two goddesses fell in love with the same man and they spent years fighting for him. One of the goddesses was the queen of the other world and the other was the goddess of love. Please help me show this story with the statues. I'm gonna go back to the radio. Okay, that was a clue, I guess. Are these animals related to Mary in any way? Yes, all of them have a relationship with Mary in a general sense. If you mean my blood through family relations, then that's symbolically also a yes. <sighs> Do y'all think the boar is the creepy uncle? I want out. I want to wake up. Wake up, bitch. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't want to go talk to the boar. Okay, bunny lady. Penguin man. He told me to go there. Fox lady. Sit and relax. Enjoy yourself. You have all the time in the world to do what you want. Help. Oh my god. I feel super stupid. I feel like it's a thousand wonders that I managed to get dressed every day without like trying to shave my armpits with my own teeth right now. Mm. Okay. Okay. So they were both after him. Okay, didn't get a minute. Let's let's try this one more time. I don't know why I didn't even thing to check two goddesses fell in love with the same man and they spent years fighting for him one of the goddesses was the queen of the other world the other was a goddess of love so who is this Okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, I did it. I did it? Okay, okay, cool, cool. Uh, do I not get anything for that? <laughs> no leads, nothing. <laughs> Just this. Okay. Wonderful. Hum hum. Alright, let's go uh, see if something else happens. Hello, penguin man. Hello. Welcome back. I used to manage to help Bunilda. It's very nice of you. Since you're here, would you mind lending me a hand too? <laughs> okay. Excellent. Thank you for your assistance. I read a book by an author named Williams a while ago. It was about a stuffed rabbit. Unfortunately, I can't remember what it looked like. Could you find it and tell me what color it is? Oh yeah, that one was, uh, wasn't that here? Yellow. Okay. It's yellow there. Okay. Oh my god. My dyslexia is like loving this right now. 
Oh, you're right. Excellent work, Mary. There are so many books to enjoy. What a time to be alive. You're not alive. You're a figment of my mind. Okay. Hey there, kiddo. What's up? You've been hanging out with Benilda and Gwendal. Hey, what about me, huh? All right, let's play a game. You up for it? Great. We'll just play a game of hide and seek. I'll hide somewhere in this room and you'll have to find me. For this round, you'll get 45 seconds. Just halt me again when you're ready. I just realized the, oh my God, hang on. Mm. Look at my mouth. It's because uh, my headphones are really loud and it's coming through on my microphone and uh, it's trying to lip sync to the song. All right, that should fix it. Just talk to me again when you're ready. Okay, this is gonna be where the horror probably started. Try to find me before the 45 seconds are up. I hate this, I hate it, thank you. Where you at, bitch? It's hide and seek, you're not supposed to. Oh God, oh, hey, you found me, nice work. I just guessed. I just clicked somewhere. <laughs> Let's play another round some other time. Yeah, not now, that's weird. You're a little weird, you're a weird lady. Let's play hide and seek with this kid in this dream bar from the 1920s. <laughs> the faces creep me out, I'm gonna be honest. Oh, hello, Mary, my special girl. Are you having fun in your dreams? No. Oh, that's a shame, Mary. Did you want something more fun? I'm afraid you'll just have to wait just a little longer, Mary, and we can do some more pleasurable things together. This went dark really quick. Be a good girl and play with your friends. It'll only be a little longer. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this, please. Girl, wake up. Something beeped. Oh, mm. it's my computer. I was holding shift down so long. It was like, do you want to turn on sticky cube? Nothing works. There's a big fluffy bed, so sweet. Great, great, great. Can we get in it and like leave? Frickin' A. Hum hum. Oh, Mary, you're back. I've been looking for you, Teehee. I'm not in a good mood now. <laughs> Do you think you could help me with the statues again? Bitch, why? They look fine where they are. You see, the statues are each supposed to be holding something. One has a flower, one has a red fruit, and one has a gold fruit. Secondary puzzle. The thing is, I don't know which statue is supposed to hold what. Please match them for me. The gold fruit is the prize for the winner. And I have the flower, right? Yeah. The statue has an engraving on its foot. The red fruit is death's temptation. Um, because of them, he was slain into- Oh, she won! The goddess of love mixes blood with nectar, making flowers broom. Bloom, please help me. Show this the name. Okay. The flowers broom, yes. Okay, so she would have this. And what was it again? I think that's it now. I got it. Yay, me. I really asked you for help, Tihi. I'm really glad I asked you for help. Yeah, me too. It was it was really fun. These were great times. Can I like jump? It's morning. <laughs> the moon is pale in the sky, and the mountains fade in the distance. And I jump. What the fuck? Listen, this is a lot. So these are all relatives, right? One was the nanny or the tutor. And I don't have a mom. One is an uncle. I don't remember the other one. I'm gonna be honest. The maid, the na the tutors. So that would probably be this guy, the teacher. Wait, so who would be the fox lady? I have to look up more books just to. They've been bothering me for quite a while. Okay, another puzzle. 
a white book with stories that have morals. <laughs> the first one, wait. I don't know who read that. Okay. Isn't that a care? Is that? Okay, so that wasn't it. Ah. It was a trick question, you motherfucker. The other book is a green book with an author whose name begins with an S. Could you remind me of the title? Since you're a figment of my imagination, does it matter if anything happens to you, Mr. Penguin Man? Hmm. I'm wondering. Oh, God. This is the real horror of this game. This is this is it. This is it. I'm literally going crazy. I'm going insane, motherfucker. Oh god damn it. Can't think. I hate this keyboard. <laughs> you did. Boom. Oh my god. I can't brain. No. Yeah, that's right. I know. I know. I finally... I... Uh... <laughs> Shut up. Oh my god. Well, let's not do that anymore. Okay. If she makes me find her again, god damn it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 25 seconds! Or what? Or what? Or what? Or what? Oh my god. Or what? What does that mean? Ugh. I'm actually scared of what happens if I don't find her, and it's probably nothing. I probably just have to do it again. Mm-hmm. Here we go again. Welcome back, dear. Are you done playing with your friends? Oh, but it's not time to start yet. We're still missing something. If you can get three seeds from your friends, we can go deeper into the dream together, Mary. All right. Be patient for just a little longer. You're such a good girl, Mary. Ugh, I'll be waiting. Ugh. <clears throat> Here we go again. Why is it seeds? Why is that so creepy to me? Why does that bother me? Hang on. My eye is itchy. Hi, Mary. You want a seed? But that means you'll be leaving the stream. Aren't you happy here, Mary? It'll all be over. We'll all be over. Oh, but if you're sure, how about this? I'll give you the seed if you can answer a question about the story I told you. Oh no, I didn't pay attention. Okay, I'll give you the seed if you get the question right, but if you don't, you need to give me one of the flower petals. The question is, who did Adonis love? The underworld lady, right? Wrong! Looks like you'll have to give me one of their flower petals, Mary. Did her face just get a little weird? Or is that just me? But I'll give you the seed anyway, since you're such a good girl. Got a red seed, lost a flower petal. That's it then. Have fun in the rest of your dreams, Mary. What the f <laughs> Oh. 